In this video we're going to demonstrate how to do a ketone test strip. This is a simple urine dip test to detect the presence of ketones in urine. Uh, urine ketone testing strips are the most widely available and most commonly used form of screening for ketones. In people that are either diabetic and wishing to ensure that their control is good and there's no ketones in their urine, or people who are on Atkins diet and similar restrictive diets who are looking for the presence of ketones in their urine as an indicator of the effectiveness of their diet regime. Uh, the brand of ketone tests we're going to show for you today are Mission Ketone Test Strips made by Acon Laboratories. Now, ketone test strips are widely available in the United Kingdom. They can be purchased online, usually in packs of 50 or 100 test strips. Best value packs are the Mission 100 Ketone Test Strips and it's a single pad test which detects ketones in urine. If I open this pack and remove one of the test strips, it's very important to put the lid very tightly back on each time you open the tests. These and other URS products are all susceptible to absorbing atmospheric moisture and spoiling and if that occurs you'll see that the colour on the pad when it's taken out dry and fresh from the pot does not match this negative indicator bar here with the handle symbol shown on here. When they come out fresh they should be a completely negative colour which is this form brown colour. Now to perform a test it's very easy. You just dip one of these tests into a freshly produced urine sample. These only go in for a couple of seconds and then you're waiting for a two minute development time and then you're matching the colour change on the test pad with the colour codings which will be shown on the side of the test pot. Now the darker the shade of purple that's developed over a two minute period the more ketones are in the urine sample and you will by matching the pad colour to one of these predetermined colour pads get a semi-quantitative result. Uh, so for instance if this pad matches with the first bar you're looking at this result here and by reading the level underneath you'll be able to determine the presence of ketones to a rough level in terms of how much is in the urine sample at the time of testing. So if we now have a look at this pad you can see that it's changed from being completely negative to being approximately the same shade as this colour bar here. So that indicates the presence of ketones in this sample at or around that level. So this is a positive test determining the presence of ketones in the urine sample. Now once these test kits have been opened, even if they have a long expiry date on the pot, the manufacturer's guidelines is that they should be used within three months. So even if they've got an expiry date that is good for another year or 18 months after you've used them, you do need to be aware that if you're getting these test pads out and they're not matching that initial negative colour pad when they're dry, you need to replace the test kits as they have absorbed moisture and they are no longer reliably a good indicator of the ketone level. So that is the Mission URS1K or single pad ketone urine test strips.